hi, this is John Marshall, the Drill Master. Um, one of the problems with having these uh, extra clips, the, the quick change clips they're called, is that it, they can fall off. Uh, they can make a nice sound for you, but they can fall off easily. So I recommend either closing it really tightly with a pair of pliers or just remove the thing. Now, uh, I'm going to remove this because this sling, you can see, is just really, really too long. And here's how I'm going to do that. I'm going to loosen this quite a bit. You see here, the sling, the sling is sewn. And what we're going to do, since I don't have a pair of scissors with me, guys, can I need you to come over here, just grab this real quick. You're in the sunlight. There, that's it. All right, so what I need to do here is cut this right below where it's sewn. There. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. So I'm going to take that off, and then I am going to cut again. Please be very careful when you're doing this. I don't recommend a carpet knife at all, but that's all we had at school here at uh, Florida Prep. And that's okay. I'm just going to be very careful. So we cut that all off. There. Now what we're going to do is cut off maybe three, four inches. No more than that because then the sling will be very, very short. So we're just going to cut off some some length there and what okay. I'm going to so do is we're going to remove this quick change clip set it aside if we ever want to use it again and then we're going to pull this through like this How we, oh we're upside down hold on there I'm gonna pull this through like this we're going to give ourselves plenty of room in here this is what we're going to do. I'm going to pull this through and then through again. And you can see there how it's doubled through and you'll, you'll need a, a decent amount of room. Sometimes if there's enough plastic in these you can actually burn the end and it will fuse together and we'll try and do that a little later but I want to have the clip right at the, uh, the, the end of this uh, uh, part of the pistol grip, the small of the grip, since this is the uh, the Glendale M1 Garand, I want to keep that right where it is, so I'm going to tighten that, and then I'm going to pull this through, so it's still a little bit to go, tighten it as much as possible, there we go, there, now we're not going to have any noise, we don't actually want noise uh, for color guard. Uh, and we have a clip, uh, we've removed the clip, we've removed the uh, excess, there we go, excess material. We're going to loop this back through, and since we're working color guard, we have this fastener on the outside instead of, there we go, we have the fastener on the outside instead of having it on the inside because we want to be able to uh, pop this open and then run that up for sling and tighten slings. Alright, this is John Marshall, the Drill Master. Thank you.